time is it? You guys want to watch an old board game from the 90s? Yeah. Yeah, let's watch an old... It's not... It doesn't have really anything to do with it, but anything to do with weeaboos, but fuck. This is an old... Doesn't want to displease his pissy wishy queen. We'll do the Cat Dennings video some other time. All right, this is called Party Mania. It's basically, um, ah, fuck, what was that? Nightmare, but for girls. Instead of having to stop the black hole and the gatekeeper, you get ready for a party. You got to get ready for a party to impress the dudes that want you. And you got to do house chores. It's basically the same game. Uh, we're not going to watch the whole video. I'm going to skip around because a lot of the video is a clock with like cheesy 90s music. But yeah, this is an old board game. Let's get ready for a party. This fucking party mania. This fucking early 90s, late 80s. This is like 92, 93 at best. Saved by the Bells, fucking early 90s. Clarissa explains it all. Fucking bullshit. It's so cheesy. I love it. I got married in 93. Wow. You had your 30th anniversary last year. Congratulations, dude. I'm an oldie. The 90s is the best year for retro games. Yeah, you got some good shit. I'm proud to be Lukester's right. Oh, yeah. Up next, Party Mania Instructions. Gonna find out how to play the game. All right, so I'm at the shopping mall. I'm at the shopping mall. My dad got me a Sega CD, and I'm buying uh, Lethal Enforcers, Sonic CD, and I got a power base converter because I want to play my old Master System games that I still have in a closet. I just got a pretzel, and I'm just, and I just got a Pearl Jam CD. So we're just kind of fucking around. My mom's getting her nails done. Hey, how's it going? Did hey, you what's up? Twins party tonight? Yeah. Max and Luke. Luke looks like Jean-Claude Van Damme, and that's cool. Jean-Claude Van Damme is awesome. Max, he looks like a new kids on the block dude. Yeah, the whole class is invited, and it's going to be a totally killer party. Jean-Claude Van Damme. We're all going, and, well, I was kind of hoping that... You could, you could... He kind of sounds like Van Damme, too. Make it. I... That haircut, though. Yeah. <laughs> I think we'd have a black, black. Besides the lead and lead and Katie, I do wish I grew up in the 80s yes. and 90s. What's that? Your mom's having people over for dinner tonight. Yeah, it's ass. Killer party, dudes. Whoa. I wanted to play Lethal Enforcers. I just got it. They gave me a pink gun. Look at this thing. It's fucking rad. I got Mortal Kombat CD. I was going to listen to Pearl Jam. It was going to be a cool night. And my mom's like, hey, we're having some friends and you're on over. And I'm like... Fuck me up the ass. Although, I didn't say that to her face. I said it behind her and she could feel the heat. And you got a whole load of chores to do? What a bummer. Yeah, that's too bad. Hey, but... Look at this pretty boy. But look, maybe we can help out. Yeah, because well, I'm really... This, this was filmed in Canada, and you can fucking tell by hearing them. I'm really hoping I'll see you there. Okay, so here's what you should do to make sure you can go to the party. To... All right. Well, I kind of didn't want to go to the party... You heard, I got a Pearl Jam CD, and I was going to spend tonight playing Lethal Enforcers and Sonic CD. I got a new Pearl Jam CD. Come on, dudes. I want to go to party. I, I was going to lock myself in my fucking room. First, pick your favorite color pawn and put it on the board space that match it. Favorite color pawn? What the fuck did you just say? I'm hoping I'll see you there. Okay, so here's what you should do to make sure you can go to the party tonight. First, pick your favorite color pawn and put it on the... Oh, pawn. Like your little character piece, all right. Board space that matches. Then, everyone's got my ass two off. chore cards. Major bummer. And two note cards. They're chores. Max looks like a younger Kyle Chandler, Dan Swerthworth, legitimate son. I mean, like, they're chores. It takes, what, like two hours at most to do it? You go, get it done, you can play more Sonic CD. 
or you can play more Master System games since I bought a power base converter. Isn't retro collecting best in the 90s where a fucking game isn't 300 fucking dollars unless it's a Neo Geo? Chore cards are bogus, but no cards are cool. Now the bogus. Chore cards are the things you have to do before your mom will let you come to the party tonight. So you definitely want to get rid of them. Just do your fucking chores. It takes like an hour, maybe, to do it. Get it done, do it. Remember, whenever you land on a get rid of a chore card room space, you can get rid of a chore card if you have the one that matches that room. Yeah, like, like let's say you land on the get rid of a kitchen chore card space and you have a kitchen chore card, you can definitely get rid of that kitchen chore card. These are so fucking Canadian. Chore card then. I think she gets the idea, Max. Yeah, no shit, dude. Oh yeah? No shit, eh? You guys are fucking wasting my time, buddy. I want to go home and play fucking Sonic CD. Well, if you know so much about it, why... Don't... YTV is playing Power Rangers. I want to watch it. Why don't you tell her the other ways to get rid of chore cards? No problem. If you're the expert, fucking tell me, dick. If you land on a friend's color space, you can give her one of your chore cards. And if you land on your own color space, you can get rid of two chore cards. If you can give her her, how do you know I'm not playing this game with my little brother? How do you know it's not dudes playing this game? Tisk tisk tisk. Pretty cool, huh? Hey, wait. Pretty cool. Forgot about note cards. Hold on. What are note cards? Let's get into that. See, note cards are real blast. Max. Oh, I already read that. Get rid of chore cards in a totally outrageous way. Yeah, you gotta watch the clock real close, cause things can get pretty tricky. So keep your note cards in order, with the earliest time on top. Hey, good idea. That way you can keep track of what you've got to do when the clock says it's time. Okay. So here's how. So most of the game. It's not these, like, really goofy fucking, like, Sega CD cutscenes. It's literally a clock counting down or counting up. And as the clock changes, like, shit happens. It's literally nightmare for girls. Let's say you've got a note card that says... Excuse me. Sorry, Kyle. Like ballerina at 121. Keep an eye on the clock. And when the time is 121, choose a friend and then start acting like a ballerina. Go ahead, Luke. Well, if it'll help you get to the party... Here goes. Then your friend has to guess what you're doing. Uh, let's see. You're a ballerina, right? That's right. When your friend guesses right, you both can get rid of a chore card. And if you're no... This is an old board game from the 90s. Uh, back in the 90s, if she's on the... Oh, God! Uh, back in the 90s, you got VHS tapes with board games. I had one. I had, um... Y'all y'all remember that show Gargoyles? It was Disney's attempt at making like a Batman the animated series. It was a really good show. Uh my I had a Gargoyles VHS tape that had a board game attached to it. And you got to watch like I think the first two episodes of Gargoyles. But after that, there was a fucking VHS tape that you can play, and you had to like pause the tape, play the game, and keep it play. It was really cool. There was a Star Wars one. Uh, Nightmare, a bunch of Nightmare, uh, yeah. Night, yeah, the Gatekeeper! But instead of the Gatekeeper, it's your classmates. Note card involves everybody, then everyone can get rid of a chore card. But try to be quick when you're acting on a note card, or guessing what someone else is doing. Everybody else gets to keep playing the game and taking... He really does sound and look like Van Damme. It's fucking cool. ...turns while you're busy with the note card. He looks like he should be doing splits and kicking. And don't forget... While you're doing your chores, you also have to get ready for the party. Dude, tuck that belt in. Dude, his belt's all fucked. Yeah, you know, the things you do to make yourself look great. There's a get ready token for each of them. Your hair, nails, makeup, outfit, jewelry, and shoes. Outfit? <laughs> I love how you can tell it's Canadian because of how they say out. Van Damme's illegitimate son. <laughs> they don't say out. They say out. <laughs> get out of the house, you hoser. He is at least 20. Internet blood sports. Kuma, say it, say it, Kumate. He's looking like he's getting ready to fight Chom Lee. So remember, and this is major. If it's the start of your turn, Kumate. and you don't have any chore cards, pick up a get ready token. And when you've collected all six get ready tokens and you've done all your chores, you can go directly to the front porch. If you're on the front porch at 6 o'clock, your mom will most definitely let you come to the party tonight. But check this out. If you get to the porch before 6 o'clock, you've got to see if your mom is cool with the way you did your chores. That means... You gotta take your mom around. Hey, here's how I... Italian leaf or he's something. And like, hey, mom, here's the kitchen. All right, I got the chicken out defrosting for you for the party. 
I uh, did the dishes, put them in, I rinsed them off, put them in the dishwasher, put, and they're good. I put them up, did the bathroom, that toilet. Uh, you can eat off that fucking toilet. You want, you want to see me eat off it? No, you don't have to eat off it. And uh, my bedroom looks good. I didn't shove anything under the bed. See, look at that. My closet's clean. I organized my Sega Genesis cartridges. Put my Sega CD games up. I organized my fucking Mega Cards and fucking Sat or uh, Dream <laughs> Master System games. My fucking Justifier is all wrapped up. I got my new kids on the block poster looking good. I'm, am I good? Whenever it's your turn and you're on the porch, you've got to pick up a mom's stamp of approval card and do what it says. Hey, well listen, we got to split, and I know you want to get jamming on those chores, so we'll see you later. I don't want to do chores. I want to play Sonic CD and listen to Pearl Jam. And I'm uh, really psyched about seeing you tonight. At Not the half as psyched as I am. Are you guys going to fight over me? What the fuck? <laughs> See you there. Hey, mellow up, dude. Anyways, we'll check hey, you mellow out. mellow up, dude. I really hope that I'll see you Come there. on already. I got shit. If Leafland had the mob problem like the U.S., could you imagine the Canadian Mafia? See ya. Later. Hi, sweetie. Hey, Mom. Listen, I'm going to be running around like crazy today getting ready for dinner tonight. Remember I told you Aunt Franny and our neighbor? My mom looks like Mackenzie Phillips. Why does she look like Mackenzie Phillips? Neighbors, the schlumpers were coming over for dinner. The Schlumpers? That sounds like a fucking, like, Nutty Professor movie. Nutty Professor 3, The Schlumpers. Imagine Canadian French mob. <laughs> oh, God. Now, I know you really want to go to that party tonight, but I need you to help me out today. I didn't want to go to the party. You said I should go. Mom, I wanted to spend tonight listening to my new Pearl Jam album, playing Sonic CD and Lethal Enforcers. My dad got me that Sega CD for my birthday, and I can't even fucking play it yet. First of all, before I go, everyone needs oh to go and die. And the person with the lowest number gets to go first. And when they're Gay. done with their turn, they pass the die to their left. Left? Left? Who's left? Hi, Pumpkin. <laughs> hey, Dad. Nobody left, dear. I'm just talking to our daughter here. Oh, hey, that reminds me. While your mother's out, Pumpkin... Joey Jojo Jr., you're not going to that party. I don't want to go to the party! I want to play my Sega CD. My dad works hard, and he provided me a Sega CD for my birthday. I'm going to be cutting the grass, so I need cutting to the grass. Look after little Billy for me. Now make sure the little guy doesn't get into any trouble, okay? My dad is such a fucking Canadian. You got mowing that grass, you fucking hoser. What was that pumpkin? No, I didn't say anything. Make sure your dad doesn't get into any trouble either. I always get a little nervous when I see him with his tools. Now, where was I? Oh, yes. Don't forget that you have to do your homework and practice the piano. I didn't want to practice the piano, Mom. That was something you made me do. The piano is fucking gay. And if you land on either of those board spaces, you're just going to have to stay there until your dad or I say you can move on. Gay. I don't want to do homework. I already did my homework. I did it in study hall. I know I'm not supposed to do it in study hall, but I did it anyway. Doing it in st if I do it in study hall or if I do it at home, it doesn't matter. I'm still fucking passing the glass. Class. What I know, Leafland had biker gang problems with those guys having access to military guns. Holy fuck. Until we do, you've got to skip your turn. Sorry, hon. But <laughs> sorry, hon. Let's play that. I love how Canadians say sorry. Until we do, you've got to skip your turn. Sorry, hon. But at least sorry. you get to play your note cards when it's time. Now, the other big thing is, I want you to be nice and polite if anybody calls on the phone or comes to the door. Duh, I'm not a fucking social retard, Mom. Gag me with a fucking cock. Jesus. If you have the die in front of you and you... Ow, you smacked me! You know how I feel about those curse words. Hear the sound. That ah. means somebody wants to talk to you. Sorry. So when you hear that sound and it's your turn, say hello. Pay attention and follow the instructions you hear. Okay? Here, let's Got it. You know, I'm not a retard, Mom. I can take care of myself and my little brother. Let's give it a try. Ready? Hello? Ahead, say hello. Hello? That's good. I'm sure you'll do just fine. Yeah, I can take care of myself, Mom. I'm 16. I don't need this kind of shit. Stop suffocating me!
I'm running away. I'm going to Hollywood. I'm going to be a big actress. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Now, you have my permission to go to the party tonight, but you only get to go if you get all your chores done and are waiting on the porch by 6 o'clock. Why do I have to wait on the porch? Why, why the fuck do I need to wait on the porch? I got my chores done. What, 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 what is this? Remember, no chores, no party. I didn't want to go to the party. You're making me go to the party. You're like, you got to be more sociable. You got to get out there. You got to talk to people. I don't want to go to this party. Fuck. You'll just have to stay home with the family tonight. I don't want to stay home with the family either. I want to lock myself in my bedroom. I want to turn on my Sega CD. I want to play fucking Lethal Enforcers, Sonic CD, and Mortal Kombat CD. And you can't stop me, Mom. I'm 16 years old, goddammit. If I want to listen to Pearl Jam, I'll listen to Pearl Jam. And Nirvana. And Sublime. <laughs> they just teach us not long ago to talk to strangers. <laughs> yeah, and what's so bad about staying at home with the family? The boot. I hear Aunt Franny's gonna be making her special dessert tonight. Aunt Franny's fucking desserts are awful. You know what I call them? Canadian x lax The only difference between that and x lax is you don't know where the fuck it's coming from, but where it's coming from, once it starts, it does not stop. Just be glad you didn't inherit his sense of taste. Anyway, sweet Aunt Fanny Fanny. Sweetie, thanks for being such a good girl. Hey, I'll no be problem. calling in from time to time to see how you're doing. Oh, and don't forget... You don't need to check up on me. I'm 16, Mom! Get to pick up a get ready token whenever it's the start of your turn and you don't have any chore cards, okay? Got it. Feel free to listen to your radio while I'm out. But cool. if you want to go to that party, you better get started on your chores right now. You've only got... I'm going to put the Sonic CD... Uh, soundtrack uh, ra CD in my radio. I'm gonna skip past song number two, and we're gonna listen to the music. I heard the Japanese version has different music, but I don't think so. Got until six o'clock. Bye. I can get these chores done in that time. Begin playing now. So I'm gonna be skipping around uh, during this game because most of this game is just a clock. But wait, hold up, hold up. Breaking news, people. Sorry about that. It was one of those fucking Indian callers. And I grabbed myself a drink. Ooh. Alright, so this game is basically this. This is what you see most of the game. ALR. This is what you see most of the game. Sa. You hear, like, early 90s, like, kind of, like pop rock or something and then we see a clock we're gonna be skipping this and we're gonna be going to the the fucking like goofy cutscenes. hello hello stephanie I, I mean julia i mean what is your name oh. my name is lola franny you know my name sa i'm by gift card sa <laughs> Right. Listen, dear, this is your Aunt Franny. Or my name is Judy, or whatever the fuck. Joey, call me Joey. Call me Joey, Aunt Karen. Did your mom tell you that I'm coming over for dinner tonight? Fuck me, I gotta clean my bedroom, too. God damn it. Now, you know I'm allergic to dust and dirt and fuzzy little things, so I need you to make sure and dust and vacuum everywhere and everything. That's right, dear. So pick up two new chore cards now. That's it. Suck my dick. 
Hello, ma'am. Put credit card information on Fishing Sham email. Good girl. Remember, I'm counting on you, Christy. I mean, Lauren. I mean, Sandy. My name's Joey. And my name's Joey. You used to clean my diapers, Aunt Franny. Yeah. Gotta fucking make sure everything's clean. God, gag me with the fucking spoon. Hello? Hi, sweetie. I'm calling. Hey, Mom. I'm calling you from the supermarket. I just wanted to make sure that everything is okay. It is. Can you pick up some poutine? That shit's banging. Great. And if anyone is practicing the piano or do doing homework, you can now get back into the game. Neat. <laughs> this is not bad music. It's like, oh, hello? Hi, it's me, Wayne, and I... <laughs> Holy fuck, these do! And together, we are the Super Brothers! These are the characters in, like, a 90s kid show. They're, like, the weird, mad scientists that make all the cool gadgets. Like, the, the, like they'll make, like, a watch that lets you cheat on tests and stuff. <laughs> it's, like, Saved by the Bell or something. Like, the weird, mad scientists that invent everything. And we made a tennis racket that can fire tennis balls at high speed. And then the main character uses it to cheat at tennis. <laughs> but, but then he learns at the end that it was him being good at the game and not the tennis racket or some stupid shit. These are like the, like the character, like the inventor characters. Worldwide Incorporated. Do you have a copyright? Can I, can, I can steal that. So we're calling to make sure you're going to be home tonight. Oh my god, he looks like Spoony. <laughs> he looks like Spoony one. That's Noah. Noah, what's up, buddy? We'll be by at six. I just hope you're home. I can hardly wait. I mean, I'm so excited about tonight. I'm shaking. These are, these are so Canadian. Holy fuck. <laughs> yeah, and I'm measuring how much he's sweating now, too. Pretty. That's pretty interesting. You don't need to measure that. You can fucking see it. Cool, huh? Yeah. Anyway, just to make sure you don't go to that stupid party, you've got to take two chore cards right now. Better make that three, okay? Yeah. We told the Keller twins we couldn't come to their party because we wanted to be with you. You could have just gone to the party. I mean, I don't know. You guys seem like, I don't know, I don't know. You guys seem like nice guys. You could have gone to the party. You could have had fun. Both think you're pretty special. Talk to you later. Bye. Later. They seem like nice young men. Hello? Hey sis, I took care of the laundry. Little Billy, why do I need a fucking phone call? It's my little brother. He's home with me. He's doing the laundry. He's helping me with the chores. All by myself. Oh, cool. See? Ow. Like, no answer, stranger, phone numbers. Well, this is back before Scream. People didn't have caller ID, so it was just you picked up the phone and answered. Eh, someone didn't tell you that clothes shrink in hot water. It's all right, little bro. I'll, I'll, uh, you should have asked me to help you with the laundry. I, I got the time. Uh-oh. Maybe you should take another chore card. Did you just wink at me? You must be in his 40s by now. going to wear this to the party tonight, were you? Hell no. That shit's some fucking Kmart shit. Straight up now tell me, do you really want to love me forever? Oh, oh, oh. Or I call in a hit and run. Don't, don't ask me how I know that. You don't like Paul Abdul? Hey, pumpkin. Hey, Dad, what you working on? Almost through fixing the lawnmower. Just took me a little longer than I expected. And he, and he Dad, that lawnmower is busted as shit. Get a new one. You got a good job. We're a fucking white family in the 90s. We're a middle class white family in the 90s. We live in a big mansion. We can, you can afford a fucking lawnmower, Daddy. Get a good one. Get a better one. That one sucks. Anyway, I need you to take the clippers and trim the grass around Mom's flower bed. So pick up two more chore cards. Thanks, fucking. Suck now, my dick. The clutch mechanism connects to the flywheel. <laughs> hey, sis. Hey, 
Okay, bro. It's a great new way to clean the windows. See? Where's the... Don't do it. Turn it on. You fucking spaz. You fucking idiot. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, kid. Fuck. You fucking dumb fuck. Fuck. Uh-oh. You're cussing in the house again, Joey. I don't give a fuck. Maybe I'll clean this up. I'll clean this up. You do... do Make yourself useful. Do the dishes or something. Jesus Christ Almighty. I'll clean this. Card. Fuck! Didn't even want to go to the stupid fucking party. Don't hurt me. I'm not gonna hurt you, alright? I'm just mad, alright? I'm I'm not angry. I'm just upset. Go go watch the get up get get away from me! Hi sweetie. I'm calling you from the supermarket. Mom, how long are you gonna be at the fucking supermarket? Joey, stop yelling. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, all right? I'm sorry. God. Go wash the dishes, all right? I'm just... I'm having a bad day. A really bad day. Mom, how long are you going to be at the fucking supermarket? You've been there for like two hours. I just wanted to make sure that everything's okay. It is. Great. And if anyone's practicing the piano or doing homework, you can now get back into the game. Thanks, Mom. This is music when, when you, like, call up, like, a customer service line. This is the music you hear. Your call is very important to us. Keep holding on the line. You are 12th in line. Hello? It is a oh, shit! That's Kaylee from Firefly. She was also in a Disney Channel show I used to watch. Kaylee, what's up, Kaylee? What's good? Hi, Catherine Andrews. Comment allez-vous? Oh, that's right. You don't speak French. I didn't take French class, bitch. I like you, Catherine, but you're kind of a bitch. All right? What do you? What the fuck do you want? I took German. Fuck. In any case, I was on my way home from the conservatory when I realized. The conservatory? You hadn't been invited to my very prestigious dance recital tomorrow. I bought a ticket. Dude, we're friends. We're cool, right? We hang out. Catherine, I I'm going to your fucking dance recital. God, you're such a pretentious bitch. You're lucky we're cool, because if we weren't, I'd fucking power slam your ass out the fucking driveway, kick your ass down one side of the street and up the other. But we're cool. What? You've got other plans? Yeah, I was gonna play Sega CD. My dad got me a Sega CD. I've been wanting to play Sonic CD all fucking day, but all I've been fucking doing is doing fucking gay-ass chores, keeping my mentally challenged brother from breaking shit, yeah, she actually is in her 40s now. Uh, that's, um, God, what's her name? Jewel, Jewel Stite? That's Kaylee from Firefly. That, that's Kaylee. She was also in a, uh, Disney Channel show and a bunch of other shit. Uh, she was in that show in space! She was that girl with the rainbow wig, the space show. Space Cases. She was in that. She had the rainbow wig. Yeah, that's Jewel Stite. <laughs> and she's so shocked. Alright, I'm not gonna power slam you, or kick your ass up the street and down the other. I'm upset. I'm having a really bad day, Catherine. What do you want? Oh, well, um, if, if I helped you with your chores then, would you be able to go? Yeah. You know, I got you. I helped you with your shit. I helped you with your piano recital. A lot of Nick shows are made in Montreal. Yeah, Are You Afraid of the Dark is another one. I helped you with your shit. You can help me with mine. We're buds, Catherine. We're friends. Fist bump that shit. Bump the fist! There we go. You what? Great. You may now get rid of two chore cards. You're cool. I like you. So this is why we hang out, Catherine. You're cool. <laughs> Hello? Hey, it's me, Becca. How's it going? What's up, Becca? I wanna, I wanna play Sonic. I just, I just bought a copy of Sonic CD. I got a power base converter. I got the new Pearl Jam. And all day, all fucking day, I've been doing nothing but 
goddamn chores and dealing with other people's bullshit. Please, for the love of God, let me lock myself in my room and just play my Sonic CD. You sound like Chris Farley. What? You've got more chores to do. I don't want to do any more fucking chores. Oh, excuse me. That's the, that's the fucking Mountain Dew talking. Hold up, I got another one in the chamber. Uh, ooh! Total drag. Listen, if you help me with my homework next week, I'll help you get rid of one of your chore cards right now. What fucking homework do you have? Calculus? Fuck me up the ass. Alright, I'll do it. Okay. Hey, what's a best friend for? Bye. Some fucking friend you are, bitch. Calculus? I don't know how to do that. I'm in basic math. Sounds like a Rick Astley song. Never wanna hurt you. Never wanna make you cry. I will love you till the end of time. You're the one that makes me feel. Hello? I'm fucking grooving the Rick Astley. Hi there, Bridget. I mean, Brittany. I mean, what one is you? Did you just call me Bridget? It's Joey. Your name? Oh, anyway, listen, dear. This is your Aunt Franny again. You know, I just can't remember if your mom wanted me to bring my special sweet potato jello and olive dessert tonight. Don't bring any of your fucking gelatin desserts. That shit is fucking Canadian x lax the only difference between your gelatin desserts and actual x lax <laughs> is, at least with x lax you know where it's coming out of. With your shit, we don't know, and it doesn't stop when it starts. Bridget is trans, according to Daisuke. Yeah, I saw that. What's that? You don't think so? Oh, well, have your mother call me just to make sure. Oh, yes, and the person with the least amount of chore cards must pick up two more chore cards right now. Ta-ta, Tracy. Just fucking flip the bird to the screen while you're at it, bitch. I mean, Mary. I mean, Jenny. <laughs> whatever. Yeah, whatever. Fuck you too, bitch. You'll remember my name when I'm hacking it in your fucking face. Fuck. Mom said I had anger issues. That's why I had to go to that special therapist. Calm down. Calm down. Hey, Mom. Remember, if you don't have any chore cards at the start of your turn, you should pick up a get ready token. And if anybody's practicing the piano or doing homework, you can now get back into the game. Piano class sucks, Mom. The only reason I do it is because you want me to. I don't want to play the piano. I want to be a computer programmer or a celebrity or whatever the fuck I said at the beginning. Celebrity. I want to be a celebrity. I want to be on movies. I'm being David Lynch movies. I'm being on Twin Peaks. Or Northern Exposure, if they'll have me. I'm going to be in the next Lucio Fulci or Dario Argento movie. I'm going to be famous, Mom. I'm going to be in fucking Lloyd Kaufman movies. Mulholland Drive in real life. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to run off to Hollywood. Hello? Hey sis, I thought I helped put away the dishes. Aw, oh, thank you. But do you know what this one goes? Oh shit. Oh shit, are you okay kid? Oh my god, your face hit the glass. Oh fuck, no, 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 no. Hold, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up. Let's get some fucking iodine on that shit. Come with me to the bathroom. Jesus fucking Christ. Are you okay? Look at me, look at me. Do you have any glass in your eyes? No, 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 no. No glass in your hair. Oh my god, kid. Jeez. Christ. I'm just happy you're safe. Jesus. Uh-oh, maybe. Alright, you're looking better than I thought. Let's, let's go check your hair for glass and let's get that iodine. Jesus. You should take another chore card. Some decent music. <laughs> Honestly, the music's not bad for like a board game. Hello? Hey, pumpkin. Dad, why do you need to call me from outside? And gee, just buy another lawnmower. This piece of shit's been fucked for years. I've told you that. 
Why do you think the last time I mowed the lawn it didn't look right? That thing does not work! I need you to do me a favor. Dad, why are you so fucking cheap? You make good money, look at our fucking house! Buy another lawnmower! That thing sucks! I've had fucking scooters that worked better than that thing. Go over to the Goldman's and tell Herb. The glass mate may sugar glass? Probably, yeah. Daddy no! And get me one of Mom's hairpins from upstairs? Oh, and if you could grab me a roll of paper towels from the kitchen, I'd really appreciate it. You're the best, Pumpkin. And pick I got you, Dad. While you're at it. Now, Suck my dick. What did you say, Pumpkin? I said, I'm right on it, sir. Go. Suck my dick. Who the fuck? Hello? Hey, you look great today. I was on my way to soccer practice. I look great? I had to clean up fucking blood for my little brother after he slipped in glass. Had to help my dad with his bullshit lawnmower because that bastard's too cheap to buy another one. Cheap fuck. And I had to do a bunch of other shit, but how are you doing, Max? And I wanted to stop by and see how you were doing. Oh, you've got a lot of chores. Oh, that's a bummer. I had to finish mine yesterday. Anyway, I really hope you can make it to the party tonight. I think we could have a really great time there together. Dude, you are staring at me so intensely. This guy, like, that is like, why don't you come over to my house, Matt, or, uh, fucking Joey? I'll fucking skin you alive. Yeah. This guy is scary. Give me Van Damme. Fuck, get away from me, dude. Jesus. You know, dancing or, or even hanging out. You want to play Lethal Enforcers? I got Mortal Kombat for the Sega Genesis. You want to play that? That's pretty cool. And I've got this game. If he had the voice of the Joker. Get ready token that I want you to have. Oh, I hope thank you. Can you. Use it tonight. Bye. Stop staring at me, fuck! Hit the bricks. Let's play Sonic and Knuckles. Fuck yeah! Actually, we would only be playing Sonic. Actually, we would only be playing Sonic Two. Because I'm setting this in 1993, Sonic and Knuck Sonic 3 didn't come out until 1994, and same with Sonic and Knuckles. Let's play Sonic Spinball. Hello? Hey, it's me, Becca. Sup, Becca? I'm having a really bad hair day. I don't know what I'm going to do with it for tonight's party. Hey, can you give me back my Nirvana CD? I know, I know, I lent you my fucking Nirvana CD. And you still have it, in vitro, give that back. That's a good soundtrack. Really? You curl it? That's a great idea. So how's it going? Yeah, everyone's got this huge amount of chores to do before the party. You know what I think would be really cool? I think the person with the most chore cards should pick up a get ready token right now. Becca? Look, my dad's calling me, so I gotta get off the phone. My dad's calling me and he sounds a little drunk. Let me get off the phone before you hear the bell. Talk to you later. Becca! You son of a bitch! You didn't put the chicken out the defrost! Oh, fuck. Daddy, no! Wow. She has some fucking issues. Hello? Hi, sweetie. I thought I'd pick up a cake just in case your Aunt Franny made a special dessert. I know you're... Ooh, is it an Oreo cake? Is it an ice cream cake? What cake is it, Mom? I bet it's Oreo cake. Or ice cream. Ice cream cake's good. That's like the perfect cake. Your dad's the because you got ice cream and the cake. It's like a perfect blend. Only one who likes it. Anyway, if anyone's practicing the piano or doing homework, you can now get back into the game. Cool. Thanks, Mom. Yo, what's up? Hey, sis. Since you and Dad are so busy, I thought I'd make lunch today. Looks good, huh? What the fuck did you make? Well, I was watching this YouTube video, and I saw his vegan recipe, and I decided to make that. Billy, that looks fucking gnarly. Gonna skip ahead as going on the new bingo card. Your brother is a ginger. Your brother is a ginger. Dude, that looks fun. Let me just dump that in the disposal. I'll make us some uh, bologna sandwiches. And we'll have uh, bologna sandwiches, some chips, and we'll just sit down for a little bit. And then I'll get back to doing the chores. Ugh. Uh oh, maybe you should take another chore card. 
You don't look good, kid. Does it do kids? Hi there. John Claude Van Damme, what's up, dude? Dude, you are fucking awesome in Time Cop. That movie was rad. I just stopped by because I was wondering if you want to go to the party tonight. You know, I wanted to make sure you... Honestly, I'm only going to this party because my mom wants me to. Take another skip this part card. If honest, if if I had it my way, I'd be sitting in my room, blaring fucking uh, Sublime, Pearl Jam, Nirvana, Soundgarden, and a bunch of other people, Green Day, and I'd be playing my Sonic CD game, my Lethal Enforcers game, but no, I gotta go to this gay-ass fucking dumb-ass fucking party. I gotta fucking... Or it, it's either that or hanging out with my boring-ass aunt in the fucking slumpers. Man, girls went from these clean-dressed guys from the 90s to metrosexual twinks in the 2000s and still going. Had enough get-ready tokens and everything. See, I've got an extra one, and I've been saving it for the longest time. I'd really like you to have it. Uh, thanks, what? dude. You gave me a coin. This is a fucking pog. Well, I gotta go, but... I'll see you tonight, right? Maybe we'll get a chance to talk and stuff. Maybe even dance. Okay. Anyways, I better go. See Beat ya. it! Hit the bricks, dude! Burn the coal, pay the toll. What a fucking- these people are fucking weird. Hello? Listen, dear, this is your Aunt Franny again. I made my special jello dessert for dinner tonight, and- Oh my god, there's vegetables. Is that a habanero pepper on that? What the fuck are you making? It turned out wonderfully. Now don't tell your mother, but I... Whenever she jiggles it, it makes the fucking like... I added a special new ingredient. Mm -hmm. Now remember, dear, your Aunt Franny's allergic to dust and dirt and... Sardines? Ew, bitch, you're putting... So what the fuck? Do you not have taste buds? Bitch, that is fucking nasty! The only thing that should be eating that is a fucking garbage disposal. Fuzzy little thing, so I need you to make sure and vacuum and dust everywhere and everything. You already have. How wonderful! Well, why don't you pick up a get ready token then? Bye bye, Betty! I mean, Sally! I mean. <laughs> you will remember my name one day, bitch. When you're when the machines are helping you breathe, when you have a thing connected to your bladder so you can pee, you will remember my name. Or not. <gasps> Ew, don't never make that fucking noise again. Fucking nasty. Hey pumpkin, take a look at this. All right. Good as new. <laughs> You know, Dad, you could have bought a fucking new one, or a riding mower. We have a big yard, you could have ridden around the riding mower. Hmm. It's a little more work here. Oh, and if Mom calls, could you ask her to pick me up some motor oil? Thanks. And if anybody's stuck practicing the piano or doing homework, you can now get back into the game. Fucking Canadian fuck. Love you, Dad. Why? Hi, sweetie. Listen, I'm just leaving the mall, and then I'll be home to... What's that? Pick up some motor oil for Dad? All right, dear. Hey, can you, um... Can you pick me up an issue of Game Pro Magazine and Nintendo Power, if you don't mind? If I have to do all these chores, I don't want to go to the party, but if I have to do all the chores... You might as well do something for me, and I kind of need the new issue of Game and for Game Pro, cause I want the cheats to Mortal Kombat CD and my copy of Revenge of Shinobi, if you don't mind. You know, not a big thing. You're already at the mall. Head into the Funko Land, pick up an issue. You know, a simple five-minute trip for you. A five-minute trip for you. Five hour trip for me, you know, you know. Oh, and listen, honey, I need to have the good tablecloth iron for me tonight. So everyone should pick up a chore card now. Shay's beautiful. She looks like Mackenzie Phillips. Thanks, sweetie. Bye. Bye, Mom. Fuck. The 
Wanna do this? I wanna play my Sega. What? Hey, how's it going? Yeah, I just wanted to give you a call and uh, see how you're doing. Becca told me you still got a major amount of chores to do. I'm definitely hoping you'll be able to get them all done in time. I mean, uh, I'm counting on. What games you got on that computer, bro? You got Ultima on there? You got Duke, no, Duke Nukem wouldn't have come out at the time, but Doom would. You got Doom on there? Can it play Doom? Can that computer play Crisis? Can it play Crisis? You being at the party. So go ahead. Pick up a get ready token right now. That's your token. Okay. Well, look, I got a motor. So I'll see you tonight. Let's play System Shock. Tomb Raider and System Shock wouldn't have been around at 93. What? It's Wayne and Oscar. Kid Kyle Chandler is rocking. The Schlumper Brothers, Worldwide Incorporated. Why do you have to say Worldwide and Incorporated? Do you not have a copyright? Patent pending. <laughs> yeah, and we've been doing some high level research into fashion. In the fashion. These are the type, these are the 90s nerds. Like, not real life 90s nerds. They'd just be called a faggot and pushed into a locker. No, these are like the TV show 90s nerds. These are the guys that invent like super putty that makes you jump 500 feet in the air so you can win the big basketball game. These are the guys that invent like fucking like a high powered tennis racket or like a super skateboard. Like, these are the cool 90s nerds. They're both really into looking good, you know? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you're not dressed badly. You're like, you're pretty dapper. We discovered that the key to being an image stud is great looking hair and a pair of... He really does look like Spoonie. He looks like a young Spoonie. Really cool shoes. So I invented this new type of self-styling hair mousse and gel that I'm going to try out tonight. Uh, that looks like fucking pistachio pudding. You better give me some of that shit so I can eat it. Yeah. Uh, you're not supposed to eat this. This is hair mousse. Well, my tummy says it's pistachio pudding, so give me that fucking thing, nerd. Yeah, it's pistachio pudding. Check these babies out. Makes you want to boot. Are those bowling shoes? I am not wearing bowling shoes. If they were Chuck Taylors, I'd wear them. Chuck Taylors are fucking cool. Yes, Anyway, just to make sure you don't go to that stupid party tonight, you gotta take two chore cards right now. Talk to you later. How many chores do I have to do? It's a fucking house. It's a finite area. What, does she want me to fucking clean the garage? Suck my dick. Bye. Later. They seem like nice kids. Hello? Hey, sis, don't worry about the chimney. It's really clean now for sure. Is that fucking blackface, my guy? Dude, what the fuck? <laughs> Uh-oh, maybe you should take another tour card. You don't need to clean the fucking chimney. Smell you later, nerds. You don't need to clean the chimney. No one's looking up the goddamn chimney, kid. Ugh, oh, I'll fucking clean this. Why don't you go take a nap? How about that? Hello? Hi, sweetie. I just wanted to remind you to pick up a get ready token if you don't have any chore cards at the start of your turn. And if anyone is practicing the piano or doing homework, you can now get back into the game. All right. Oh, that's nice of her. Hello? Hey, it's me, Tanya. I'm... Oh, hey, Tanya. My token black friend. What's up, girl? Totally psyched about the Keller Twins party. And you'll never guess what I do. I'm glad she forgave me for calling her the N-word the other week. In my defense, it wasn't E-R. It was A. I thought you people liked it. God, I fucked up. Proceed. Proceed. Celeste, who called Tisha, whose brother Gary is best friends with Taylor, said that Luke and Max are arguing big time over who's going to dance with you at the party tonight. They both want me? That's fucking weird. Can we do like a tag team thing or like ones and... I thought this was an episode of That's So Raven for a split second. That's So Raven is 2000, early 2000s, not early 90s. 
You're so lucky. I think you should. She does kind of look like Raven. To give one of your tripods to every player right now. Gotta run. Bye. You gonna call the other people? Gossip queen. Oh fuck, it's her. Abra, abra, cadabra. I wanna reach out and grab ya. Hello. It is I, Catherine Andrews again. Oh, it's this pretentious bitch. Fuck do you want, Catherine? I've been trying all day to give away tickets to my fabulous dance recital tomorrow, and you know what? Nobody wants to come. I'll go to your dance recital. I'll dance. I'll watch you dance. I I've seen you dance before. You're pretty good. Uh, uh yeah, I'll I'll go. What's it's up? It's just no fun being perfect like me. You are very con I like you. You're a cool kid. You are very fucking conceited. You gotta work on that girl. If you must know, I'd really rather be just like you. I give No. Oh, oh, stop. You're making me blush, bitch. Anything to go with you to the party tonight. Hey, I'd even I'll let you hang on. You can be my little toady. And help you with your chores. If Hell yeah! My little brother just made a fucking mess in the living room with the fucking dust cloud. Uh, can you handle fucking coal? We can go together. I can? That's great! Pick a get ready token now, and I'll see you tonight! Hell yeah! Get your ass in there, get them dishes done, mine the broken glass, and then you work on that fucking stove that it... Little dipshit, I'm sorry, little Billy fucked up with the, um, the fireplace. So get your ass in there. What a dork. Catherine's cool, I like Catherine, but she's a dork. You're a dork! He's fat! What did you just say? Nothing. She's so cool, I don't like her. <laughs> Who it is? Dear Miss Dorothy Higginbottom here. I want to remind you, you have a piano lesson on Monday. Re Fuck! I hate piano! You old bitch! You fucking dusty ass, crusty ass, musty ass, fucking dust shooting out your vagina ass bitch! I hate piano class! I do not like piano! The only reason I do it is because my mom makes me! Remember dear, every chance you get it's important to practice, practice, practice! And then one day maybe you'll be like me, substitute organist every other month. What's that? You're lonely. How are your cats doing? And I mean that. You've already practiced twice today. Bravo. As a reward, you can get rid of the rest of your chore cards. Oh, shit. Thank you. Wow, thanks. Wow, wow. You with the clutch. Holy shit. Thank you. And remember, dear. You're cool. I'm sorry I called you a dusty, musty, vagina shooting dusty woman. <laughs> Every chance you get, practice, practice, practice. You know what? I will. Maybe my mom was right about piano practice. Maybe there's some merit to that. Hello? Hey, pumpkin. You came hey, at just the right time. I'm about to try this again. Now stand back, just in case. Let her rip, Dad. It works. Hell yeah! I'm brilliant. Yes! Oh, and if anyone's practicing the piano or doing homework, you can now get back into the game. Hey, Dad, maybe you were right about keeping that old piano, or keeping that old lawnmower. You got it working, you know? I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. You clearly, you know, you're older than me. You probably know more about You've been around the block, you know? You got it working. Sorry, Dad. Hello. Whew, it's good to be home. Hey, Since Mom. Your dad's still out cutting the grass. I need you to help me unload the groceries. Thanks a bunch. Oh, oh. Hey, I'll do that. Yeah. How much you've been in that grocery store for like four hours? I'll help you out. Oh, and why don't you give one of your chore cards to another player right now? Hell yeah. All right. Yo. Hey, it's me, Tanya. I've been talking to everyone, and the whole class is going to the Keller Twins party. But you know what? Angelina heard that Paula said that Sheila will be wearing the exact same thing that I got for my birthday to the party tonight. Who cares? 
Oh, you're wearing the same thing I'm wearing. You know what I'm going to be wearing at the party? A fucking Nirvana shirt, a flannel shirt over it, and some blue jeans. Oh my god. There's a party. It's not like a fucking... It's not like a fucking get-together from the medieval ages where you have to be, like, all dressed up. It's a fucking high school party. Just wear your fucking... Wear what you're wearing now. God. That leaves me with nothing cool to wear. What? You let me borrow something of yours? Wow, you're so great. You know, you can borrow this fucking Sonic and... No you can borrow this Sonic 2 shirt I got for Christmas. Here you go. Wait, lie tell Gina. Pick up a get ready token and get rid of one of your tour cards right now. I'll be right over. Cool. I don't have any shirts to give this bitch. Almost time. Who it is? You know, I really appreciate your help today. And to help you make it to that party, no one has to practice the piano or do homework anymore. Yeah, it's five at night. I should have my homework done. Yo! Yes, dear Miss Dorothy Higginbotham again. I want to remind you to take extra special care of your hands when you practice, practice, practice. I recommend a manicure before every session. That way you won't get hung up on a hangnail or... What's that? Oh, you've already given yourself a manicure. Bravo! Bravo! You may now pick up a get ready token. And remember, dear, every chance you get, practice, practice, practice. Yeah, I practice the piano a lot. Like, once a day, it sucks. This song also sounds like Hydra City from Sonic 3. Dude. Not a bad bop. Yo! Hi, it's me, Max. Yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to the party tonight. Not as much as I am. Hi there, Jerry. How does it feel having a brother being Jean-Claude Van Damme? You know what this is? Like, yeah, imagine getting into a fight with your brother and he just kicks you in the face and does the splits. <laughs> That'd be embarrassing. It's me, Luke. What's that? You still got a lot of chores to do. Oh, no, I meant I could help you finish them. Hey, you couldn't finish tying your shoelaces. Look, I'm the one who can really help you with your chores. No way. All right, two dudes fighting over me, yeah. I can help you much more. Hey, all right already. Just chill out, dude. Anyways, you can get rid of the rest of your chore cards right now. And, uh, I'll see you tonight. You mean I'll see you tonight? Wait a minute. They're gonna fucking kill each other. Hey, it's me, Becca. Time Yo, told Becca! I you something for the party. So, I was thinking I'd let you borrow that new skirt I got. Uh, Becca, you know what they say about chokers? They're literally the black belt for dick sucking. I wouldn't wear that to a party. Damn it, Kyle and Jean. Yeah, I wouldn't wear that to a party. People will think you're a slut. Yeah, don't wear a choker. It's literally like black belt for dick sucking, or you're a tranny. You know, the one you said was really cool. What? You're not done with your chores yet. Wow, total drag. Look, don't panic. I'm coming over right now to help. So get rid of all your chore cards right now. Hey, what are best friends for? Bye. I'm already doing your fucking calculus homework. Fucking slut. Game over. Greetings from the Slumper Brother. Sup, boys? Woo, we're going to have a good night. Worldwide Incorporated and live in your living room. <laughs> yeah, we're extremely... What's up, Spoony? Dude, oh my god, you gotta review Final Fantasy 13 too. You said you would. Going to that stupid party tonight, because that means Oscar and I and the entire Slumper Clan... Dude, <laughs> what the fuck was that face? Did you see the face that dude made? No! Oh my god, let's let's rewind that. <laughs> Nerds, let's look at the face the other guy made. Not going to that stupid party tonight, because that means Oscar and I and the entire Slumper Clan. <laughs> that face! He looked like he was nutting. It's Oscar and I and the entire Slumper Clan. Yeah. Get to spend Ugh! Imagine you wake up and someone's making this face in front of you. That means Oscar and I and the entire Slumper Clan. Ugh! Get to spend the whole evening with Hufflepuff face. With you. Yeah, the whole evening. Everywhere you look, it'll be slumpers, slumpers, slumpers. <laughs> we brought an extra pair of our special dancing shoes so we can. Why are they glowing? 
Why are they glowing? It all boogie down after dinner. And to help you look your best, we brought you a fresh batch of our self-styling hair mousse and gel. <laughs> yeah, and we made it even better. <sighs> now it comes with a new lima bean fresh scent. I bet it'll look great on Put that shit down. Get your ass into my room. We're playing Lethal Enforcers, and I get to use the gun controller. And then after that, we're watching Ken Hedenlotter's uh, Basket Case, and then you're gonna listen to my new fucking Pearl Jam album. Now get your ass up into my room. Now! And you. Yeah, and, and smell, smell great too. too. <laughs> Ooh, they got pinball. Hell yeah. Wow, I'm so glad you could make it. I didn't want to make it. I'd rather spend my night playing Sonic CD, but here I am. Everybody's here and they all keep asking me if I've seen you. Why am I popular? I don't like any of you fucking assholes. The only one I probably like is Catherine, and that's because she's, like, nice to me. Thanks, the skirt. It was great with my blouse. You're such a... I didn't wear that shit anyway. That wasn't even a skirt. That was a curtain I used to block out the sun. I didn't want the sun in my room when I was playing Mortal Kombat. Good friend. I tell you what Jennifer... But at least you like it. It looks good on you. Celeste, who called Fisher? Hey, I'm told... Yo, fucking Han Solo over here. Only psych you could make it. You really know how to keep a guy in suspense. So you want to dance? I don't want to dance. I want to attack the snack tray and drink some Mountain Dew. Hold up. Let me take a sip. Cane sugar. That's how you know it's good. So fast, Max. I'm glad you could make it here. This will make it an excellent party. Yeah, speak. You guys are gonna fight over me? All right, Jean Claude, uh, Kyle McLaughlin. You guys get into the square circle. Um, first one, the Kumite uh, loses, and um, I won't take the winner. I don't like either of you, so I want to go home. It sucks. I hate it here. My fucking feet hurt. All I want to do is attack the snack tray or play the pinball machine. This sucks. I wish I was home. Of excellent. You look great. I'd really like to dance with you. Give her a break, Max. Schlumpers, schlumpers, schlumpers. She just got here. So, would you like to dance? Did I hear someone say they wanted to dance? You know, this fine girl, this really nice girl, she's single. One of you guys? Hmm? Uh, she's... That's Kaylee from Firefly. Who wants to date Kaylee from Firefly? Come on. She's dressed like Blossom. This party is simply superlative. Yeah, this is... Well, I hope you have fun. It's a really great party. I'm, like, so glad you can make it. I know this is gonna... I did not want to be here at all. Uh, I want to tell you guys the truth. I did not want to be in this fucking place at all. Fuck! The, at least you guys have liquor... Did some, one of you guys steal your dad's booze or something? Fuck. It's gonna be the best night ever. Hey, come on, everybody, let's dance. Yeah. Get ready for dancing. This is the whitest dancing I've ever seen. The fucking buttercream dancers, the buttercream gang is better at dancing than you fucking people. This is the whitest dancing I have ever seen. I'm literally like sitting at the wall with a drink in my hand, my foot at the wall going, it sucks. I hate it here. My feet hurts. No one knows how to dance. All I want to do is play my Sega CD and listen to my Pearl Jam albums. This blows. I want to know what year this was made. Holy shit. At least with the fucking Schlumper Brothers, we would have been playing video games all night. Although one of them would have tried to make an awkward pass at me and I would have just, like, punched him in the fucking nose. Fucking poser. 1990? Oh, shit! I was right! 93! Oh, yeah, I am fucking good. What time is it? 3.25. That's going to be it for tonight. Tomorrow, it's either... I don't know. It's either going to be another game or Spoonie1 talking about Final Fantasy VIII. 
one of those two. You guys have a good night. I will see you guys later. I hope you enjoyed the party. I'm out. I got a Pearl Jam CD to listen to, and I want to play Sonic CD. Later, hosers.